Hi people, today we are looking at the art of meat piddle. You should definitely check out their art on DeviantArt. Yeah, meat piddle draws some cute little, well, sorry, I shouldn't say little, cute big ladies. Starting off today, we got fashion for the rabbit year. This is probably one of my favorite oh, in their gallery. Uh, is this a particular character? Oh, she, yes. She's from Quintessential Quintuplets in a freaking rabbit onesie outfit. That is freaking adorable. So there's five of these people. <laughs> uh, yes, yes. We can only hope the rest of them are as large as this girl. <laughs> it's so cute though. She looks so grumpy as well. Is that like raspberry slice or something? So cute though! Nice work. Love the texture you've put all over it as well, Meat Pedal. This is what you call a fashion Ford lady. Yeah? Here's a mood to start the year with. I'll leave it up to you to decide whether the complicated expression on Nino's face is due to the suit not being what she expected, or because she was forced to don it too early. I didn't know I needed this, buddy Nino is so good! We also got putting the soft in goth. Yo, not quite as large as some of the ladies they draw, but I think we can all appreciate some goth. But, but my lunch was just as big as before. Grumble. Oh, the tum is really shiny. It is, yeah. What is this she's wearing? Like a very, very shiny, shiny top with another top over the top of that. And again, this is a very, very fashionable look here. Very weeby, maybe a little cringe, but the good kind of cringe that we love. What does it say on her mug though? Morbid. <laughs> she's going all out. No holds barred. Chubby goth Jeff with twin tails? Perfection. Cute outfit. Even cuter woman inside. <laughs> Sun Sun, but also fat. Wants you to notice her belly. Will certainly complain if you do. Hasn't gained any weight. But if she did, it's your fault. Pushes herself to gain. Like it. I actually like women who communicate um, what they want without being um, sundere about it, but I know there's a lot of Sun fans out there, so you know this is for you. Love your friggin' Princess Leia hairstyle, I guess we got here. Bro, look at those socks! Those are gigantic those. socks. Imagine what they look like off, off their feet. <laughs> those are some XXL socks. But they look so cute though! Oh, you're a big lady, you need big socks, don't you? All of the above describes someone who somehow, paradoxically, is more attractive as a result of her personality. Yeah, yeah, this art is cool, but have you ever heard of garlic bread? I prefer rye. Okay, I respect that is kind it, of base. Is it rye like a darker bread? I don't know, yes, I don't know if I like it that much. It's classy. Rye is classy, though. Fundraising for a failed feedy. What's the background here? Get your Liz Love tour shirts now! Also available in certified idol size! She's so cute! This woman's just got like happy girl energy. I don't know. She looks so bubbly. <laughs> Look at how round her face is! She's got like colored ends of her hands. Weird. It's, it's like taking nail polish too far. <laughs> you just dipped your whole hand in the, in the nail polish bottle. <laughs> Couldn't bring myself to cut, cut the tradition after all, so here's a rushed Elizabeth somewhat unwillingly begging her fans for support. She was coerced by a PR team. <laughs> Liz Love Tour 2022 has regrettably been cancelled due to budgetary disagreements. If you wish to give this top idol another chance, you may contribute to next year's shows by buying the official Liz Love merch at justiceforliz.com. This idol size must be the standard one. My jaw is on the floor! She could put me down for an order of 10. That is exactly what super fans would do. Why do you need 10 t-shirts? And if just, you just use one, you can make it your, your curtain unless it's so big. I mean, sh that's true. The Road to Beasthood prologue. What? I'm sure the boss won't mind if we save that just a teeny bit of what will be left of humanity. Their accomplishments with food were always their greatest. Oh, this is also from Fate. Again, don't know much about Fate, but oh man. This lady so, looks so like fabulous. A, a demon flight attendant or something? Demon oh, flight right. attendant, yep, on the plane to friggin' hell. You will be well served. Oh my god, those, god, it's so good. The outfit fits just right. Look at, oh, look at that friggin' hair. 
to destroy humanity. She just has to become the Lost Belt herself, right? There are going to be many Lost Belts before she's done, that's for sure. <laughs> I have no idea what you're talking about because I'm one of the unenlightened non-fate enjoyers. Scouting for the best buffet. The catering head! Huh, better be whew, worth this! I love the, the vibe here in the background. Cat maid out at midnight. I mean, I know cats go outside in the dark, but I didn't know cat maids did. I love this outfit. Even got the little cat bell there. No. Oh. Halloween, Christmas, Easter, the cat will fit in with any season to sneak herself into the dinner table. I hope that I'm not dreaming right now. She is way too good for this world. I'm afraid, I'm afraid you may be dreaming because cat girls aren't real. Pitiful mouthfuls. Power! Do you humans not have bigger morsels? The ones you have offered are insufficient to sate my appetite. Yeah, those are little burgers. We can do better than that. We literally, you could buy bigger burgers than that. Denji is just being, or Makimo, or whoever is buying you the burgers just isn't getting you the XX super deluxe big burger. They're like, ooh, here's your, here's your freaking snack burger. Doesn't even, doesn't even any like coleslaw or mashed potatoes there. You have to get her a family sized meal. This woman has needs. This is another one I think is really good. Love the wrinkles on the clothes. The burgers are great. Her face is, oh, that's a soft face, round face. Love the shine on the hair. And oh boy, the chum. I'm not familiar with Chainsaw Man, but hey, it's got good fatties, so that's probably good. It's a bit hit on this, but there's a lot of stuff to attach onto, depending on your watching preferences. Powers a Canon Glutton though. Canon Glutton's are always good. It doesn't have fat characters in it, unfortunately. Not I wish even it random did. people in the background. Not that I can think of. Not that I can think of. Um, I've only seen the anime. I can't comment on the manga. House number X of who knows how many. Here, here too. The Santa really like this at every house. Is this Pedoro? I don't know if it's Pedoro. Fates Irish Kigal. No. In the midst of an attempt to better her divine reputation by taking over for Santa this year. I don't think this is Pedoro. I'm pretty sure Pedoro is different, but this is another fake character. Filling in for Santa and not realizing the struggle that Santa has to go through eating that much cookies every single year. Can you imagine that? Yeah, but Santa Can is physically impossible because one, you have to drink cookies and eat and drink milk, drink milk and eat cookies, and you have to fit down chimneys. That doesn't make sense. That is kind of contradictory, you're right. He has magic, man. He has magic. <laughs> she's so cute, though. Maybe she's a rookie, but she's a cute as Santa. Not the date you expected. Not like the pictures, please. It's what's inside that counts. Now then, I believe you're going to treat me to lunch. Well, it better be a good lunch, because that's what's going to count, isn't it? What? What? With the, the pictures lying about her size or the fact that she has freaking shark teeth? Do not trust a woman with teeth that looks like this. I'm just saying. Tum though, tum. I could look, I can see why you went for the tum, but like the teeth, a birthday gift for Ichigo 30 of his OC, Hoshi. Hey yo, nice OC man. I was sold at the part where I told was told that she's an absolute brat. Simply the worst. Wolf Tom! Spice and Wolf fan art. Love seeing that. Never have seen the anime, but um, I, I like seeing people drawing it. The, the Chonky Goddess. Those apples had to go somewhere. Wonderful work on the cloth here, Meat Petal. Beautiful work there. Cloth and here, I think Meat, Meat Petal does a great job on both. I guess she's probably been wolfing down some spice apples. Wolfing down some spicy apples. Well, if you want to check out some spicy apples, if you know what I mean, you can find plenty more art and a lot of quintessential quintuplets fan art over on Meat Petals Deviant Art. That'll be linked in the description, so go over there to check that out. Thanks for watching, everyone. We will be back tomorrow.